What's up guys, it's FlexS here hitting you with another Games and Gains uh, workout video. In this case, we end up doing arms today. Uh, Hugh, uh, myself, and uh, another one of our crew, Jess, decided to hit some buys and tries in today's workout. Um, in this first set, you can just see Hugh here just doing some light reps of buys. Uh, we kind of do um, something we found online from C.T. Fletcher, I reckon. Uh, I, I highly suggest that you guys check them out. Very motivational, very uh, influential Influential in this workout, especially. Uh, has some massive arms. We're trying to copy him. Uh, but we do, uh, he does 10 by 10. Um, it's kind of crazy. He does basically 100 reps of both buys and tries. And we kind of uh, do something similar with very lightweight. Moving to the first set, you can see us doing some straight, uh, some barbell curls. I think I'm doing tens in this case. It's not too bad. Still warming up at this point. Um, and you can also see Hugh doing some uh, reps of ten, tens on each side, so 65 pounds. I believe this is Hugh's second set. You yeah, know, not having any trouble with a uh, great form. Really, no swing in there. Uh, looks great. You see the other people here representing the UCF gym in the background and some randos trying to step through my um, shot as I'm trying to get, you know, my arm workout in. You know, trying to take, steal my gains, that's not going to happen. In this case, I'm doing 25s, I'm starting to swing a little bit, starting to struggle, but trying to keep those arm locks by my side. Um, this is kind of a good set. I really enjoy this workout. Um, it's kind of hard at uh, UCF, being such a floor, you kind of have to fight for what you're doing. And, you know, here's the last set, it's kind of just trying to wrap out as high as I can do. I was doing actually 135, as you see, you know, the last person our crew walking around creeping creeping behind me there that's jess uh moving on to the next uh, we kind of alternate between buys and tries after we did our warm-up set we decided to do skull crushers and it's actually it's probably my least favorite lift um, and unfortunately uh, he likes to do it and uh, i have to talk myself into doing it as well but i, I tend to struggle I have a little elbow pain going on, I don't know if it's some tendonitis or something like that, but I really want to focus, in this in this lift you guys want to really focus on trying to keep those elbows uh, locked in and really not moving too much, and from there you just slowly descend the bar uh, down towards your head, you know, obviously not smashing yourself in the face, but you really want to control it. Uh, moving on, I believe Hugh is moving up to... Uh, I believe this is a 25 and a 10. Uh, actually, I think it's a 45 in this case. He's doing a 35 and a 10, so 45s on each side. Uh, 90 plus 25 is on uh, 115 in this case. You know, really not struggling too much. You see some arm shake, but this is extremely impressive for Hugh. Uh, in this next case, you really, if you guys want to see me dying, I'm doing a 35 and a 25 on each side. And right here, I'm just talking to um, Jess telling her that she's probably gonna have to spot me I'm afraid I'm gonna drop this weight on my head uh, so he can see here I'm struggling I'm getting that back lift off kind of throwing the bar up <clears throat> and you know that's one thing I want to talk about is you know you guys need to push yourself through each workout and um, unfortunately you can't hear the crew I'm with here but they're also yelling at me to keep repping and keep pushing through this set and you can see right here I'm struggling I think that's my last actual uh, rep by myself and then here's a force rep by um, with the help by Jess you know trying to lock it out and having trouble <laughs> see my forehead sweating turning red you know getting that lollipop face going on uh, you can see Hugh here now we're doing the uh, machine preacher curl it's actually it's probably my favorite machine to use during arm day uh, you kind of just throw the weight in this little sling and um, it does take a lot of the stress off the bides and it really isn't too hard uh, it does kind of activate the uh, pecs a little bit and well for me it does uh, but you see Hugh was doing I believe two plates in the last uh, in that case, I'm actually doing um, three, so this is one of my last reps, or last sets, so I'm, I'm jumping up and down, trying to help, uh, I'm essentially cheating, which is not great, so I'm kind of showing you guys that not everyone's perfect, especially me, I love cheating, I love seeing those big weights, uh, but I did, coming in with you, he's doing these two plates in the 10, he has a much better form in pretty much any lift, I used to see you can still see that he's uh, also kind of swinging the hips a little bit. 
Um, I guess this is a perfect time to also talk about the UCF gym. You see how beautiful it is. It's a nice band in Florida. I love it down here. Uh, being from West Virginia, it's quite a nice change. Um, always sunny. It happens to rain every day. It's super humid. Uh, but here's my last set. Um, I'm really focusing on trying to keep a proper form, but this is uh, three plates and two tens. I get a few reps in there, not too many. I think I end up getting like five or six um, um, solo reps. And I end up giving up. I didn't want to go to a failure. Um, this is the last actual tricep exercise that we end up doing. Um, typically, an arm day. Uh, considering we have, we for our typical rotation, we have chest day. Um, coming up next but it's after a day off so we don't well, I don't like to work tries too hard um, I prefer to work uh, do three sets of buys and two sets of tries or three sets of both in which our last set of tries is not too hard so really do two hard working sets of tries and the last one's pretty easy but this is actually a hard working set which we're using the tricep rope or the it's just the rope we really want to focus on getting the extension at the end and locking that in really controlling the weight uh, throughout the, the full range of motion and the last exercise we did um, unfortunately we don't have any video of you uh, doing this exercise but we're just doing uh, regular hammer curls uh, this weight I usually start off around 40 and keep the reps up, up high and uh, in this case I actually did the most I've ever done which you'll see here in a little bit I believe it was 70 pound dumbbells so I was kind of impressed and happy with myself in that case and here you can see me doing the 70s a uh, little bit of uh, the back flex flexion I'm kind of just throwing the weight up kind of kicking the hips to help get it up but however I do kind of control it well enough to actually say that I did um, get the weight and I can still brag about it uh, and with that, that brings the conclusion of the, today's arm workout. I guess you could say brought to you by Games and Gains. I'd appreciate if you guys checked out the site as well as the Instagram. We try to keep posting um, there uh, quite often, and hopefully it's quite entertaining. We see, I think we got up to uh, 700 followers today. So I'd like to thank everyone for the support and the help. And you know, please like, follow, and subscribe. This is Flex S out. Peace.